Hello, what are uh, your names? Uh, Steve Malone. Philip Cassell. And uh, what project were you a part of? Uh, Canned. And what were your roles? I was director, writer, and had a very small uh, acting part in it. I was uh, the star, Sherman, Kings Sherman Kinsley. That's the name of the character. The star. The star. The star. <laughs> was that, that your shirt one of the stars, too? It's making quite a statement. <laughs> Thanks. No, no, no. It's a lot of sweater vests in this one. But they are just as loud. <laughs> so are the neckerchiefs. And what was this um, film about besides sweater vests? Uh, it is about... Um, mainly Sherman Kinsley, who is the, co the coach in charge of the last group of canned laughter artists in show business. And they all find out basically that uh, their, time, their days are numbered as a group and they kind of have to contend with um, what they're going to do with their lives and for, for their, with their jobs um, after the laughter. Like that seems like such a, like a specific but really cool topic for a film. Like what made you come up with that idea? Uh, it was initially like an absurd kind of like sketch kind of idea, and then kind of grew and we expanded the characters. So initially it was just kind of like something that just sounded like funny. Like I think I was watching a some some show with a laugh track and just at you know had like a half awake idea of like oh what if they were artists? So it kind of just expanded from there. Yeah. So uh, do you have any involvement with um, sketch? It sounds like you do. Uh, I have friends that do sketches and we kind of help each other um, on projects from, from college that we help each other on anything comedy related and sometimes it ends up being short form sketches and I've made a few myself but yeah so cool. yeah um, and, and how about yourself or you like work together a lot um, this was a first time for, for us uh, but uh, hopefully not a last but really uh, connected uh, I do a lot of sketch comedy in New York City at the People's Improv Theater and other uh, fine uh, theater establishments uh, and way off off Broadway but good theaters and yeah I've been doing sketch for about 15 years um, and so when I was uh, given the script to look at I was very excited and I wanted to do anything I could to be a part of it because it had been so long since I'd done a, like a long form project where I could create a character and you know take them on a journey uh, so this was yeah a real good gift so I guess um, everything that you've done, like with um, sketch and comedy, it really helped shape you, this um, you in this role. Yeah, and not just that, like improv. Um, <clears throat> there's there was a lot of improv in the movie. Uh, I didn't know that that was going to be the case until I got there, and then I realized, mm -hmm. oh, uh, I know how to do this. I mean, I've I don't really use see improv as like a means to an end financially I feel like it's just, it's a tool I just I believe in play and I feel like it's one of the best ways of just you know exercising that that muscle of play and acting and so uh, again to like you know to be asked to do that and I wasn't even think you know I wasn't I was I was there to do the work whatever the f heck that means the work. Uh, the work the work the work <laughs> I was ready to do that and they were like yeah just just make stuff up and I was like I can do that too sure yeah and, and the fact that it worked out also real lucky. Great, great. Oh, and um, any final um, thoughts or anything you want to share? Uh, we have a lot of festivals coming up in August as well, so you can follow us on Can the Movie on Instagram for most of our updates. Uh, I guess that's all I would add right now. That's about it. Um, if you're in New York City uh, on, on August 5th, at uh, 4 p.m. at the People's Improv Theater, we're doing Awkward Family Dinner. It's an improvised two-act play. It's the first time we're doing two acts. We usually just do one. But we are doing two completely made-up acts that will never happen again and have never happened before. So come check it out. Some of the best improvisation in New York City. That's great. Not one, but two. <laughs> two acts. Thank you. Thank you.